On November 28th, we welcomed a new little girl to our orangutan family. We have now officially named her, and her name is Clementine. Uh, she got this name from the Congo Expedition staff, and one of the reasons that we chose this name is because she's little and sweet, just like a Clementine. Kali really took to motherhood naturally. From the moment Clementine was born, she's been incredibly attentive to her needs. She's been nursing her well, making sure she's nice and groomed, and making sure that she's safe as Kali moves through the habitat. Clementine is extremely strong and has been holding on to mom really well, but Kali's definitely been very cautious as she does her orangutan movements through our habitat and making sure that she's holding on to her nice and tight. Orangutans in their native range are critically endangered, so each birth is incredibly important to make sure that we have orangutans around for many years to come. Clementine's birth was a result of a recommendation from the Orangutan Species Survival Plan. These plans help ensure that we maintain a genetically diverse population in professional care. Not only is Clementine the first orangutan birth at the zoo in over 60 years, but she's also a first for many of our Congo team members. So we're very excited to kind of have this new experience and watch Clementine grow and watch Kali really fall into being a mom. Everyone has adjusted well to our new addition, Clementine. Sulongo has been very curious, but he's also been very respectful of Kali and taking her lead on when he can kind of interact with them. Uh, but he has been very gentle when we have seen him interact. And Dumplin, uh, we think for a couple of days, Dumplin really wasn't even sure what was going on, but then when she actually was able to get close to Kali and see the baby, they've kind of been inseparable ever since. Dumplin really enjoys spending a lot of time near Kali and just kind of looking at Clementine. All of Kali's maternal training really helped us in regards to being able to get a good look at the baby from day one. So Kali was very willing to bring the baby over um, and show us to her even the day that she was born. And within that second day, she, Kali was actually offering us the baby's foot when we would ask Kali for other behaviors. And she seemed very comfortable with us as keepers being near her baby, which was fantastic. Uh, we've also had some opportunities because of all the maternal training we've done with uh, Kali to actually be able to take temperatures on Clementine via a forehead thermometer um, as well as start to just work Kali into feeling comfortable with us having interactions with the baby which will really pay off down the line once we start training Clementine. For those first couple weeks Clementine spent most of her time just sleeping and eating and holding on to mom but recently we started to see her really start to look around our environment and actually notice us as keepers as well so when we feed Kali Clementine's making eye contact with us and kind of watching the food go back and forth. Um, she has really been holding on to Kali even stronger now by herself. So we've actually seen Kali do some movements where she's moving without uh, also making sure that she's holding on to Clementine and she's doing fantastic at that. We've also seen Clementine moving and changing positions on Kali's body as well, which is a good kind of milestone that she's figuring out how to move around on Kali without Kali's assistance. Kali hasn't let motherhood slow her down at all as she continues to climb and swing through our indoor habitat, as well as engage with her social companions, Dumplin' and Sulongo. We have seen lots of play behaviors between Sulongo and Kali uh, since Clementine has showed up, and Clementine's been hanging on and having fun with those play sessions between mom and dad. And then she's also had some mini grooming sessions with Aunt Dumplin'. While Clementine is very little right now and very reliant on mom Kali, we know that as she grows, she's going to get into many wild antics. Orangutan kids are known to be pretty crazy uh, and lots of fun to watch. So we really hope that everyone will come out and visit with her and watch her grow, as well as how she engages with mom Kali, Auntie Dumplin' and Dad Sulongo.